Perhaps all my life I've been training to make these works. I remember I used to count things just randomly for nothing at all. The number of steps at home, the number of lights in a certain room, or number of books I have, etc. As an adult for a brief period of time in my life, I was rendered immobile. I spent months and years going to physical therapy to relearn and train my muscles to move again. It was such a learning experience the brain had forgotten how to speak to the muscles and trying to learn or relearn or perhaps the muscles decided not to listen to the brain of training every day to be able to move to be able to build back strength to grasp a pencil or a pen to write and draw again and in doing so i would find myself again counting all day long Again years later the work that I now do is inspired by that time it takes inspirations from that lived experience and drawings for me is a way of archiving it's a way of keeping track keeping a record of my own movements I repeat an action again and again and then try to quantify it and give it a number It's an absurd investigation. It's an absurd and futile investigation into myself, into my movements. This way of creating an encyclopedia of movements, of gestures, of mark making, which is so much embedded into the ideas of relearning and retraining muscle memory. of training the brain and the muscle to work in tandem with each other if you some day see them in totality or i think of it as an archaeological dig years later if it is all discovered you would find an accumulation of data this archive of me all these movements that are so basic but yet so vital and all these marks that make these movements whether it is a gentle fluid gesture made in response to a certain music that i like or tiny tiny marks repeated till they all form a much larger picture each mark and each number talking of the body as an archive of all the trauma all the relearning all the rebuilding and the healing and the passage of time that moved or perhaps paused within these marks and in saying so in coming to that number in that final number have an understanding of what that movement meant